Now, your Super Doppler 10 forecast with meteorologist Jeff Edmondson. Wow, what a day we had across our area. The sunshine was nice, temperatures were warm. We even made it to 60 degrees in Virginia Beach today. Something else. But now something else is going to be, we're going to be shoveling snow maybe by the end of this week. So a big change is coming into our forecast. Our temperatures are in the 50s and 40s right now. Tomorrow we're looking at a high temp of 47. Rain to snow tomorrow. The temperatures will be dropping throughout the day. So in the morning tomorrow, it'll be about 47 degrees. By the afternoon tomorrow, it'll probably be closer to 37 degrees. Colder air is coming in with this cold front. The front's pretty impressive right now. A lot of rain moving through Tennessee. A couple of snow showers on the back side of the front. And that's the same thing that we're going to see tomorrow. It'll arrive as rain, and then it'll change over to snow once we can get some of the colder air to move into the region. Here's our feeder track by tomorrow morning at 7 a.m., 9 a.m. Maybe some light rain in our area early tomorrow morning, but the heaviest and steady rain may not come until the late to mid-morning hours across the re region, or maybe even by the middle of the day. So it could take a little while for this rain to move in, but once it does, we'll get that rain, we'll have those strong northerly winds, and we'll see the rain change over to snow across our area. That changeover should happen around sunset tomorrow across Hampton Road. So 4, 5 o'clock or so is when we'll see that changeover happen. So we're going to be looking at great driving conditions with just rain during the day tomorrow around our area. Tomorrow night is where there start to be a little bit of a concern. Because as the rain changes over the snow, we could see some accumulation on maybe the side streets or on some of the lesser traveled roads. That continues into the evening and overnight hours. And then on top of that, we'll have temps dropping into the mid-20s by Friday morning, and that could allow for some very icy conditions across the area. Now, going into round two, we have a couple of changes. The wind will be pretty strong, gusts to around 25 miles an hour. The snow looks to be widespread, not expecting really much for rain. Travel impacts will start to increase as we go throughout the evening on Friday. Let's start on Friday again, 9 a.m. Cloudy skies, not a lot of snow or mixed precip around our area for the first half of the day. During the afternoon, a little bit more into North Carolina. During the evening, okay, here we go. Here comes the snow. So we're starting to see it around 7 o'clock Friday night, setting up across the Hampton Road cities where it's light to moderate, pretty heavy into North Carolina by 7 p.m. As we go throughout the night, 8 o'clock, we still have the snow starting to fill in and expand across the peninsula and the eastern shore, starting to get pretty heavy across the south side. So Friday after sundown is when the road conditions start to deteriorate, and we start to see the snowfall rates increasing. By 9 o'clock, we're seeing the snowfall rates increasing even more. See the dark blue? So we're starting to see a real snowstorm develop across our area. Friday at 11 p.m., it's coming down. It's going to be a snowy night across our area. Saturday morning, it already starts to move out. So late Friday night going into Saturday morning is really our window when we're going to see the big snow across the area. When we wake up Saturday morning, might be a couple of flurries, but we're looking at a lot of clouds and temperatures that will still be cold with the clouds moving out during the afternoon. So Friday morning, things will be slippery. We'll ha or excuse me, Friday night and into Saturday, we'll have those snow-covered roads and things will be slippery. How much snow are we expecting? Well, the dark blue, that's 3 to 6. The medium blue color is 1 to 3. And the purple, which is now centered over Virginia Beach, northern Virginia Beach, is saying 6 to 8 inches of snow. So an opportunity for a good 3, 4, 5, 6 inches of snow across our area from the snow event. Travel will get worse. Friday morning, there'll be some slick spots. Friday afternoon, there'll be some slick spots. Friday night into Saturday morning, I wouldn't recommend travel as once we get that snow to come down, especially on the side streets, it'll stick, it'll be sheets of ice. It could be very slippery Saturday morning across our area. Temperatures will be in the 30s and near 40 all weekend long.